Joining us now is Tim Chung. He's a producer and a host here at Shaw TV. And Melanie Leitner is also a host and our producer here on That Talk Show. But you're here to talk about something different. It's a new segment, Foodie Fight. Melanie, what's it all about? The premise is that Tim Chung and I mm -hmm. meet a host, a, a Vancouver host or a Metro Vancouver host, and we essentially have to copy a signature a signature dish of theirs. Yeah, like a Vancouver chef yes. anywhere in Metro Vancouver, right? Anywhere in Metro okay. Vancouver. And they have they give us 20 minutes to prepare it, but we can't see how it's prepared. That's right. We have no idea what the ingredients are and how it's made. We're basically thrown into the fire, and we got to figure it out and t basically trust our taste buds. This sounds exciting. Wow. And so can you guys actually cook? or? I went to cooking school. Mm -hmm. mm, I went to a few cooking classes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, a that hasn't helped me at all, if that's your question. <laughs> okay. And you're I, I guess I'm a foodie in the sense that I eat pretty much everything. Beef uh, tongue last week. It, I'm into weird food as well, <laughs> okay. uh, as most people in the office know. Uh, but, you know, I love all, all sorts of food, so this is pretty much the perfect segment for me to be a part of. Mm -hmm. So who has the advantage, do you think? You have some cooking classes, you like to cook at home, but I think you're both chefs. What, what you know, what are we, it's what are we looking to, at? It's hard to say because it depends on the on the dish. Right. So, I mean, even the simplest thing like rice, which is what we cooked with Vikram Vij at my mm. shanty in Surrey this first episode, right. that was hard. Yeah, you'd think that we'd be both pretty skilled at cooking rice, I mean, having an Asian background. <laughs> Genetics. But uh, one of us was not as good as you'll see in this. Uh, I'm, excited. I'm excited. And are you guys nice when you're side mm. by side, or nice. how do you? No. Uh, no, we're not nice usually in the office. I was going to so say, that's how it is you, around here, so exactly. that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. It's <laughs> taking everything in me to have him sit next to me to not. Yeah. And I, when you arm us with sharp knives, it's just anything can happen. It's so oh. tempting, right? Before okay. a fight breaks out. Yeah, without further ado, I'm very excited. Yes. Uh, here is your first look at our new series, Foodie Fight. The suspense has killed me. What are we making today? So what you're going to make is this beautiful basmati rice, which comes from the foothills of the Himalayas. You're going to be using cumin, salt, onion, oil, and water. I want to give you a taste of what I have cooked. Think about it, imagine it, and then try to cook it. That's the color you should get. Okay. That's the flavor you should get. How easy is it to uh, mess this up? I'm a bit nervous. I'm not nervous at all. Really? <laughs> if I mess this up, my grandma's gonna be very upset, so I can't mess it up. It can go either way. Either it's you know perfect and delicious, or it's a complete catastrophe. I'm a Filipino girl, and I've never cooked rice in a pot. I use a rice cooker, so I look confident, but I'm a little worried. Here we go. Oh, that's good. There we go, now we're cooking. A classic dish like this takes time, so I'm not gonna rush myself. Actually, I'm gonna enjoy a little glass of water. See that, you see that caramelization? It's just delicious. Someone's getting a little overconfident. Do those look burnt to you? Uh-oh. Ah! <laughs> well, chef, it's the moment of truth. So let's go from bland looking to visually poop looking. What? It's like a perfect dinner in front of a television where you don't have to arouse either your brains or your palate. I haven't tasted this yet. I would have to call a pest control agency They're to kind of... black poppy seeds. That burnt cumin actually doesn't taste bad at all. However, uh -huh. why is there no salt? What did I put salt? How much? A pinch? Okay, so Vikram, who's the winner of this challenge? First of all, I think both of you failed. <laughs> Who was less bad? Less bad, you were less bad. Oh. Yes! The cumin was burnt and the whole pest control thing came up. I knew I was in for a bad time. You know what? I like what I made today, but I'm gonna stick with what I know, Chinese rice. And I'm gonna come here to my shanty for an authentic Indian dish. 